I take my hat off and so I clearly need a haircut. Um, my friend Greg uh, launched this company or not, it's not a company. He just created a website called you probably need a haircut.com. And uh, it's basically like surfing quickly off the, the, um, the quarantine stuff where people are locked at home. Everyone's hair is growing out. Nobody can go get a haircut. You shaved a mohawk. Uh, what he's doing is he's barbers who are also out of work. They're at home. They can do a Zoom consultation and basically help you cut your own hair. And so that's awesome. uh, if, if you need a haircut, Wait, go did, to you probably your hair looks good. Did you cut it? No, I'm going to cut it. Dude, it's awful. It's yeah, it looks, no, it good, looks right good right now. There. I agree, actually. It does look good right now. But I looked at it before this hat was on it and it looked awful. So I'm going to so go I've, cut my I've, hair. I've been cutting my own hair for 10 years now. I have I've had the clippers. <laughs> I can tell you all about it. I know how to do a fade. The other day I did shave it completely bald because I wanted to feel How do you my, do the back? Um, Sarah, my wife, will help me. But for years I would do it on my own. And admittedly, it probably didn't look great. But I watched videos <laughs> on how to like give uh, a fade. Right, and I it's it's not that hard, but uh, I I've been doing it for years just because for a long time I was poor and I didn't want to pay money, but now I do it because I'm like, oh, I don't want to like drive there. Yeah, it's annoying to go, and plus yeah, they I'm always like, make me do... take my headphones out, and I'm like, well, now I'm bored. Like you don't understand, I constantly have information going in through my eyes or my ears, and now you're making me just sit here. Like yeah, this and sucks. also I just don't want to talk to them, and I'm like I don't oh. want to, like so. So what I do is I close my eyes, and that's like a sign for not <laughs> not talk. But I but I wish that there was like an app like for at a certain barbers where it's like click like do not talk to me or talk to me. Right. Because like for weird like people like me, I'm like I'm just super. I don't like the confrontation. I just don't want to. I don't want to talk. Just leave me alone. I, I'm I don't like want that the at confrontation. <laughs> Dude, I'm like that at fucking grocery stores. You know Jack Jack Smith, he, he we're like the same way. We go to grocery stores and I'm like if I don't see what I don't want to if I don't see what I want to buy, even though they probably have it but a different section, I just Not won't asking. fucking buy it. I just won't buy it instead of ask or if I'm with Sarah, I'll be like Sarah, will you go ask for this? I, I like I don't even want to talk to anyone. Right. I yeah, think a lot awful. of people are like that. Yeah, they, they, I think did they add this into Uber where you could get in and be like, "Yo, let's not let's not do that thing where we talk." Yes. <laughs> yes, uh, and it's awesome. I just don't. I'm just like uncomfortable, and I don't want to fucking do it. I, but more barbers, do it. you know, the last thing they you know what they need at barbers is they just need like six different haircuts for men, and you just say like, give me the four. But they do have that. A lot like, of a lot don't, and you just say the same thing like short on the side, a little bit off the top. Like everyone yeah, yeah, says exactly. the same thing. It's like <laughs> it's like dude, just like show me a picture of like five people, and I'll just point. Right. Um, a lot of barbers don't have that yet. Or, dude, it could be unspoken because everybody just wants short on the side, a little less short on top, but shorter than it is currently. And you should only have to say anything if you want some other shit. Like, oh, I'm going for this other look. I want to do a look. Okay, then it's on me to tell you about the look. But if not, I just want to sit down. No words. Just do the short on the sides, a little short on top. Same. Just, like, (laughs) give me, like, three options. Like, completely bald. Uh... Like a, just a, whatever the three are, and I'll just point at one of them. And by the way, just don't talk to me unless I initiate conversation. <laughs> and do my eyebrows because they're getting a little long. I got long eyebrows. Everyone knows that. <laughs> don't well, make me ask number, you. Don't make me number, ask you. <laughs> that's the number four. Right. <laughs> and also, they say like, do you want your, do you want the back of your neck rounded or squared? I'm like, right. I don't, don't know. know. And I don't, don't care. Know. Yeah. Like, I don't see it. You you be the judge. Right, exactly. And I've, I've, at one time I asked him, I was like, what's the deal with this question? Because I don't know. And like, is, is there a difference? What's the deal? And then someone told me, actually, one of the barbers actually taught me. They were like, look, if you do square, it, when it starts to grow back out, it's going to look shitty. So it looked good initially, but then it'll look, it'll look obviously not square after it starts to grow out. He's like, do the round, because then even as it grows back... It's uh, like blends in. It's not so bad, dude. This sounds like a Larry David episode, like a uh, like. So what's the, the round of square? What's the difference? <laughs> like, I mean, we tried, uh, we tried. So uh, 